Hello and welcome to the Running Fever channel. Uh, I'm Michael Davis and welcome. If it's your first time, thank you very much for being here. Be sure to hit the subscribe button if you like it and uh, you know, hit that little bell notification so you get the notifications whenever there's a new video on my Running Fever channel. Today, we're gonna talk about the Mandrill Workout Elite Hand Exerciser Kit. This is one of those things that you, you know, do your grippy thing with. We're gonna unbox it. We're gonna do an initial review, so stand by. Okay. So we have the Mandro Workout Elite Hand Exerciser Kit. Looks like it has all these things on it, including a how-to ebook, which probably is not included in the package. So I just finally got this piece of tape off, which was really making life difficult. Very tightly packaged. You don't have to worry about things falling out. All right. And I can see it's all in this neat drawstring uh, carrying case. And uh, here we are. So it, it's in this nice um, drawstring carrying case. And uh, it's got a picture of what looks like some kind of monkey, I think. Don't know what that is. It'd be very interesting to find out. But they have chosen this creature as their mascot for the logo. All right, so this thing has a drawstring with a little thing on it to keep it tight. And let's dump out all the contents. It's a nice black. I like the colors that they chose. This is like a some kind of really green, blue-green or something. I don't know, I'm kind of red-green colorblind, so I'm not sure. Um, so I like that on the black. And I've got a nice little card that says, Welcome to the Mandrill Sports Family. Mandelsports.com. Bobo is the founder, whoever that is. Okay, so we have several items here that are all, of course, in plastic bags, as you can probably hear. So the largest one I'm going to open up, and everything is black here. I don't know if they have other colors available, but uh, black. So this is the hand grip looks like and I don't I haven't read the ebook that's supposed to be wonderful um, but this looks like it's fine it's adjustable so you can adjust the tension on it as you and there's just a spring and that's all it is it's a spring with adjustable tension and you can use it uh, and I can see that I'm yeah plus is clockwise so I'm adding tension to it and it's getting a little bit harder it doesn't really feel that hard and I think this may be slipping um, there were a couple of different brands of this I was looking for something to, to help my grip because um, what what's been happening is uh, some of the weights that I'm doing like uh, especially uh, shrugs and uh, deadlifts and things like that where I have to pick up a barbell off the ground um, is the, the ability, my grip is limiting my ability to lift weights. I mean, the, to go up in weight, basically. The amount of weight that I can lift is limited my grip. So I want to improve, improve my grip. And uh, so I wanted to get something. So a friend of mine at work, a guy at work, um, has some of this stuff, got the same kind of kit, basically. And... Uh, I looked at the brand that he got, and it was several times more expensive than this one. This one was available, looked like exactly the same thing, and I don't know where it was made. Made in China, designed in the EU. So probably every single one of these brands is made by the exact same company in China, and then they just put their different. So I'm guessing that this is exactly the same thing. I'm going to take it to work so you can see. So the second thing that I'm looking at here 
is basically just a rubber band and inside the rubber band are other rubber bands that you can put your fingers into and then you can spread them out and stretch against the big rubber band on the outside and uh, you can therefore it looks like I'm feeling my forearm muscles activating which is pretty cool because I don't do anything specifically for the forearm so um, that looks like it's going to be pretty useful but it looks kind of weird just like all this stuff um, well let's go to this one next looks like a just a How would I describe this for the people who are listening to the audio unboxing only? Uh, this is, has a spring. Uh, it's, it's got like a rectangle in the middle with uh, spring-loaded little things on the outside that you can press in like buttons. It's like pressing buttons with your individual fingers. And then there is a... Uh, a spring on the outside that's just a one piece that your palm goes into. So you put this in the palm of your hand and you can squeeze it. I think uh, this is not is not, I mean, it's got the nice mandrel workout logo on there. It's pretty slick. But it's, this doesn't, it doesn't have as much of the tension of the, uh, this thing, which is like a, uh, your typical caliper thing, except it's a, a, adjustable. I say caliper. I don't know. Um, but that the big thing where you squeeze two things together with moves on a spring, a single big spring, is adjustable. This one is not adjustable. I think it's more for individual fingers. I don't know. This is the kind of thing where I would need to um, read that e manual that they've got. That of course I can't see because it's electronic um, so this last piece I'm not so sure about it looks like a little donut <laughs> I'm not sure how to use it uh, so um, I'll have to just I'll have to just figure out what it is and read the manual or something but it's a little rubber donut so I don't know. We'll see what that does. But anyway, this whole thing uh, looks to be fairly decent quality. And uh, I'm going to check with my coworker. But I think this is the exact th same thing that he had for a fraction of the price. So I think all of these things are made in the same factory in China. Put different names on them. And then send them out. They put this nice logo on it. And the box and everything. And that's all that's different, I think. So... But uh, anyway, I'm looking forward to uh, trying these out and uh, seeing if they can improve my grip so I can lift more weights on those things when I have to grip the bar and, uh, and pull upward. So anyway, I hope you enjoyed this uh, review. And it's just an initial review. I may have another review later on where I talk about how I've actually used it and whether it worked or not. But this is the initial quality review. And it looks to be fairly decent and uh, good for the price. And I think the price was about 10 bucks, honestly. I don't, don't remember exactly, but I think it was about $10. And then you could pay probably 50 or something for, for the other uh, brand. And I bought it on Amazon. And there will be, of course, as everything that I talk about on here, you can get by going to runningfever.com and clicking on the resources page and i'll have all the resources there that um that you can uh get and you can um get, go direct to this particular brand on amazon if you buy it through my link then uh you can help out the show and help us do more of these all right well i hope you enjoyed that i'm now trying to use every single piece of equipment in the deal when I do my thing, so. Uh, <laughs> I hope you enjoyed that. And, um, you know, if you like it, uh, be sure to hit that subscribe button. 
And um, I'm really looking forward to seeing you next time. So I hope you enjoyed this and uh, be sure to uh, like and all those things that you do on YouTube. Later.